Hey guys, welcome back to BJ Tech News, episode 32. Uh, so today's episode is a little special. Um, it's a little bit of a part two of episode 28. Um, it's about the whole how to solve your profile cannot be open correctly issue in Chrome. I posted a blog. I had I got a lot of hits on the blog, plus a lot of hits on the video, my YouTube channel. Thank you everyone for the support. Thank you for the love. Thank you for subscribing. Awesome. Um, I did a little bit more research for you guys, uh, and I actually placed a Google case ticket number, whatever you want to call it. I opened up a case with them, and it was case number 0225416. The subject was basically your profile cannot be opened correctly in Chrome. I gave them a description of like, uh, this morning I received many complaints about Chrome in the office. And getting this error, I did some research and deleted the web data database. I can show you guys what I actually wrote right here. Okay. Uh, but for some reason, when the user restarted their machine and tried to open Chrome, the error message appeared. Please help. I have the users. I have the users now using Firefox or IE. Thank you. Uh, I received a notification from them today around 9.08. I received this email and once I received the email I received a phone call and I, um, on the call ID I saw Google so I picked it up. I spoke to this guy Nicholas, that was the guy that sent me the email and he basically said due to the fact that um, my company is running Google Apps Enterprise so they, do, they don't really support Chrome. So I was like, okay. So he was like, he can help me as much as possible. He sent me these links. I told him the rundown. I told him what I've done so far. And I basically said, hey, you know, I deleted the web data. I deleted the web journal. I deleted the user, uh, user data folder. I deleted the default folder. Chrome works when you, when you start it up with no problem when you do all the deletion. But the problem still happens when you restart your machine okay so you have in my mind you okay, I could just tell the user don't shut down your machine or I could create a, a, a login script or a startup script that every time the user logs in it would delete those two files and when they start Chrome Chrome will work okay but it's, it's a Google problem they should fix it um, I think this morning I received someone replied in the blog this guy right here I read it this morning and when I was speaking to Nicholas uh, the Google tech he basically told me that uh, it's probably an issue with the latest update of Chrome but I was saying to myself the the user that I had the issue you know when I had the issue when I first blogged this the user didn't have the latest and greatest version of Chrome. They had an old version. Plus, I have that stuff locked down, so stuff won't be pushed out and updated. Apparently, um, if you have version 20 something, I don't know. I don't know really. The guy didn't really tell me which version is having issues. Um, he's probably he said that Google's working on it, and probably they're gonna be pushing out updates pretty soon to fix the problem behind the scenes. They're not gonna really tell anyone, but who knows how long the update is going to pop up so uh, this guy right here blogged pretty smart he was like uh, he said I believe the latest update is the cause of, to the issue I solved it by removing the latest version of Google Chrome on my notebook and replaced it with an archive version from this website and he rebooted the notebook voila error was gone please know that Chrome will update auto update the browser each time you connect to the internet and this will update your archive version and start earlier to prevent the auto update from Chrome I have to use tune-up utility application to stop it from updating the browser so the workaround basically is to uninstall get an older version of Chrome and work with that until Chrome uh, until Google actually figure out what's going on again the technician gave me this little status page right here of, like troubleshooting but it, it wasn't I don't really know what to say. It, it wasn't really useful. Uh, let me 
see. Ah. Let's see if I can go into this site. Can't get into this site. Why is everything getting highlighted? Don't know. But it is upsetting me. Alright, guys. Be patient with me. Let me just close this up real quick. No. And. Let's open up Adobe Reader. So a lot of people are saying, you know, what the f? I really, do I really have to do this? I, I don't know what to say. You know, there's other browsers out there. There's Firefox and Internet Explorer. Internet Explorer don't even get me started with that. Um, but Firefox has been pretty stable. As you, as you can see, I'm using Chrome right now, and I haven't had that issue at all. Like right now, I'm I'm running 20.0 because apparently. It's the version that's causing all the problems. I haven't had that issue, but knock on wood, I'll probably have the, the, the problem next next week or tomorrow. But you know, he 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 gave me this this website, and the website doesn't really give you, or I don't see that problem anywhere. You know, you can filter it out to Google Chrome errors and crashes, and I don't see that issue anywhere. So. Did the technician lie to me or what? I don't know. But the guy that blogged and posted something up, you know, you guys could try this out. Let me know. Uh, comment on this. Comment on this video. T tell me what you think. Um, also, if you guys do try this out, removing the Chrome that you have and reinstalling an archive, yay! Shoot me out. You know, shoot me an email. Go to my blog at bjtechnews.wordpress.com or go to my YouTube channel and. Um, comment on it and say, "Hey, Bernard, this actually worked, um, or it didn't work, or I don't know." Right now is, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to say to you guys, you know. Um, but hopefully, you guys do enjoy this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Also, again, follow me at Twitter at BJ Tech News as well. Check out my blog for the latest and greatest updates. With uh, more to come, hopefully, more to come with um, this whole issue that. Google Chrome is having. You guys have a good one and thank you.